welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. It is that time of the year, my quarterly favorites. We're gonna be talking all things fall, some great ideas for gifts for the holiday season, and just the things that I have been loving over the last three months. I have a ton of WW food finds for you. I have makeup slash skincare items for you. And I also have a few household items, which would make fabulous little stocking stuffers or gifts for the upcoming holiday. So it is October and it is time for my favorites. So if you wanna see all the good stuff that I favorited over the last few months, just stay tuned. So we are going to start with food. We're all here for the food, right? All the WW foods that have been my favorites over the last few months. So I want to dive a little into the holiday type of foods that I've really been enjoying. Now I got into fall rather early. It was like September 1st and I was decorating my house and buying everything and anything that I could find that was pumpkin. So I love fall. It's my favorite time of year and I love all those fall flavors, that rich nutmeggy cinnamon pumpkin flavors of fall. So if you are interested in seeing some of the other things that I found at Trader Joe's that have been my fall favorites, I do have a video all about Trader Joe's and all of the things pumpkin and fall and spicy that I found. So I will link that video down below for you guys as well but let's get into my favorite. So Western Bagel is, as you know, one of my favorite products but every fall or harvest time they come out with pumpkin baglets. Now these are their small little bagels. So you can see here that the size of them, they are pretty small. Although they are small, they are only one smart point. So you can have a bagel pumpkin and it is absolutely delicious for only one smart point. You can't beat that. Now with Western Bagel, the best deal is when you buy one of their build your own boxes. So you can put either four or six bagels into a box and they will offer you free shipping. And then you can use my code here on the screen and you'll get an additional 10% off and the free shipping that is part of the build your own box. And you really can pick any bagels that you wanna put into there, but I highly recommend these pumpkin. They're so good, I love them toasted with a little spray butter. You can even put some of that pumpkin cream cheese from Trader Joe's, or really you could just about put anything on these. In fact, they are so good, you could just warm it up and eat it as a little snack. So definitely head on over to Western Bagel and check out all of their fabulous bagels that they have. They range anywhere from one point to five points depending on the bagel. If you need some suggestions, certainly leave me a comment down below and I'd be happy to help, but highly recommend the pumpkin baglets. Tis the season guys, tis the season for pumpkin. And while we're talking pumpkin, let's talk coffee creamer. I love coffee as you know, and there are two creamers that come out just this time of year that you can only buy this time of year. So what I do is I hoard them and I buy as many as I can possibly find and then I freeze them because they are just as good frozen, my friends. You take them out, you toss them in your fridge and you have perfect coffee creamer of your favorite flavors all year long. So let's first talk about the fall flavor of creamer. So this one I really, really like. This is the Coffee Mate and this is the Pumpkin Spice. This one is so good. It is just the right amount of sweetness and spiciness of the pumpkin. I love it. And what's great about these creamers is you can have up to three tablespoons for one smart point. That's a good amount of creamer, enough that you don't need to add anything else to your coffee to color it that creamy, caramely coffee color. Love this. So I will be ordering, buying, finding, a lot of these so that I can stash them in my freezer so they last me all year. And on this same note of the pumpkin, we also have the coffee meat in the peppermint mocha. Okay, I wanna preface that this is my all-time favorite, and since I won't be doing another favorites video until the first of the year, I wanna show this now. If you can get your hands on this, you guys, definitely do it. If you love chocolate and peppermint, you will love this. And again, up to three tablespoons for one Smart point, peppermint mocha, coffee mate creamer, pumpkin spice, coffee mate creamer, both wins. Next up is something that you know that I love. If you follow my channel, I eat this every single day, but they have come out with a new flavor that is outstanding, literally outstanding. And that, my friends, is the Built Bar. But this just isn't any ordinary Built Bar. This is 
peanut butter. Yes, peanut butter Built Bar. So here's the deal with this bar, you guys. As you know, Built Bar manufactures all in a nut-free facility. So what they have done is they have manufactured this peanut butter Built Bar in a separate facility. That way it maintains all of the other flavors to be nut-free and allergy-friendly, which is amazing that they've went the extra mile to manufacture this in a separate facility. And let me just tell you how delicious this is. It has peanut butter flavor. It isn't a slap you in the face peanut butter flavor, but it is definitely a real peanut butter flavor, nothing artificial. And that's because they do use organic peanut butter in these bars. And the best part is there are little chunks of peanuts throughout these bars. So good, absolutely delicious. Who doesn't love chocolate and peanut butter together? I love these bars. The only difference between these and the traditional built bars, besides the fact that they are manufactured in a different facility, is the nutritional in information is a little bit different. So these peanut butter bars are actually 170 calories, but they have 20 grams of protein and they are four smart points instead of three smart points. So just to recap, all of the built bars are three smart points with the exception of the peanut butter. And you guys, if you like chocolate and peanut butter, Reese's, Butterfinger, real peanut butter, it is on a spoon out of the jar, you are going to love the peanut butter built bars. So head on over to builtbar.com. My code is here on the screen for you. It will give you 10% off and free shipping. And the best part is built bar allows you to use my code over and over. So write it down, jot it down, put it in a safe place because you're going to want to reorder these or all of the built bars for that matter. And you can use my code over and over. So again, head on over to built bar, score yourself some chocolate peanut butter. You won't be sorry. So speaking of chocolate, let's talk a little bit more chocolate. So I'm in loving these. I actually just recently bought these at Trader Joe's. They have this chocolate chip cocoa, and then they also have a vanilla. These are so incredibly good, you guys. This chocolate one has real chocolate chips in it. So good. So here's how this breaks down for points. These are meringues, so they are gonna be a little bit less in points than your traditional cookie or candy. The serving size is three of these meringues. And as you can see, you guys, these meringues are huge. You could have three of them for five smart points. You can have two of them for three smart points, or if you just want a sweet treat after a meal, one of these, two smart points. And it definitely cures that sweet tooth, it cures that need for chocolate, and you get that crunch of those chocolate chips. So if you have a Trader Joe's near you, you can't go wrong with vanilla, but in my opinion, the chocolate chip is the best. While we're talking chocolate and while we're talking peanut butter, I wanted to show you another thing that I am absolutely loving, and that is this. This is the Choco Right Peanut Butter Squares. You can see here, you guys, 35 calories a piece, which means that one of these peanut butter squares, and they're good size, they're like that, is only one smart point. Or you can have the entire package that has two squares in it for two smart points. You can't beat it. It is definitely a good dupe for a Reese's. It has that vibe between a Reese's and a Butterfinger, so incredibly delicious. I know that you can find these in stores, just a pro tip or cautionary measure. Make sure that you're buying the ones that are 35 calories because they do sell these Choco Right products in these same flavors that are between 100 and 130 calories a package. And that's going to put you more in the three to four smart point range. So double check the calories, make sure you're buying the 35 calorie ones. In my area, I cannot find these at the store. And I've also heard that that's pretty uncommon uh, to be able to find this particular 35 calorie one in a store. So I just order mine off of the protein wise website down in the description box. I do have a link to protein wise. The link will give you $10 off of your first order. I don't receive any type of commission or anything. It's just something that they offer to me over at protein wise, because as you know, I go there all the time. I love the protein wise website. They literally have so many WW friendly, delicious items, but this one, tops my list. So head on over to protein wise, click that link. It'll give you $10 off and check out these peanut butter cups. If you are a Reese's or a Butterfinger fan, you're going to love them. So I mentioned, I love coffee and yes, yes, I do. I love any and all things coffee. So I've been trying to find a coffee ice cream that is point friendly, delicious, and that I can just fit into my everyday as some type of a dessert or a treat, especially during the summer when it's warm out. I just wanted something cold and creamy and something just like ice cream. So I 
found these and I'm telling you, not only do these satisfy my ice cream craving, they absolutely satisfy my coffee craving. And that is the Enlightened Bars. This is the cold brew coffee chip. So this is rich espresso chips in cold brew coffee ice cream. Holy moly, it is so good so good. So if you are looking for an ice cream that's point friendly, these are only three smart points. You can't beat it. The flavor is really good. The thing with these bars is you want to take them out of your freezer 10 to 15 minutes before you eat them and allow them to soften a little bit. It really enhances the flavor and just makes it an easier product to eat. These are pretty hard straight out of the freezer and they are so good though. You let them melt just that little bit and you get that coffee creamy with those chips in it so good so i've tried some of the other enlightened ice cream bars and i was not a fan but let me know in the comments have you guys tried some of the other enlightened ice cream bars and really liked them so maybe there are some flavors that i need to try but this one so far has been my all-time favorite again light and cold brew espresso chip so good let's continue to talk a little bit more coffee before we move on to the next item I love coffee once again, and I also like having protein shakes, not only just to drink when I need that little extra boost of protein, something that's portable that I can take with me, but also something that I can pour into a couple extra shots of coffee if I wanna make that creamy, delicious protein coffee. I myself am not a huge fan of Premier. I hate the ingredients that are in Premier. They're, they're really not the best ingredients, and I honestly just don't, care for the flavor. So I tried to find another protein shake on the market that was better for you with better ingredients that tasted great. And I found it. And that is the, oh, I flipped that around. There you go. The cafe latte. And this is the iconic protein drink. So this one is absolutely delicious. So it has 20 grams of protein and it is only two smart points, just like the premier, but the ingredients in here are so good. It is grass fed everything, ingredients you can pronounce, good ingredients for you, good for your gut, good for your health, with 20 grams of protein and it tastes really good. And these are only 130 calories versus 160 calories of Premier Protein. They are still two smart points on Freestyle. So this Cafe Latte one does have some caffeine in it. So I like to have this in the afternoon, is that afternoon pick me up of caffeine. But I've also put this into with shots of espresso and it is delicious. Just really gives that authentic, rich, full bodied coffee flavor. So highly recommend Iconic. If you use my code here on the screen, you'll actually get 15% off of your order. It is cheaper if you use my code and go to the Iconic website than ordering them anywhere else. And it makes them about the same price as Premier. But again, less calories, way better ingredients, and in my opinion, way better taste. So let's talk about a couple of snacks next. So as you know, Target often comes out with Halloween sized snacks. If you didn't know that, you are in for a big treat, my friend, because they come out with some of our favorite snack items in small little miniature versions to hand out on Halloween. So it is a time for us Weight Watchers to head over to Target or wherever you can pick up these small snacks and stock up because not only are they point friendly, major point friendly, you still can have your favorite snacks. So I picked up my all time four favorites from Target. So I wanted to show those to you. So the first one is these. These are the Utz Halloween mini cheese balls. So this is the size of the package. It is a quarter of an ounce. So it is a small amount, but there is quite a bit of cheese balls in here and you can have this entire package for one smart point. So it's nice to not only throw in your kid's lunch, but to throw into your lunch as well because it satisfies that cheesy chip for one smart point. Next up is another product from Utz, and that are the Utz Halloween Bats and Jacks pretzels. Okay, you guys, I don't know what it is about these pretzels, but they are the best pretzels I've ever had. They're buttery, they're salty, they're crispy. I don't know what Utz does, I don't know what they do in their Halloween package, but they are so incredibly freaking delicious. And again, one smart point for this little package of pretzels. Highly, highly recommend. Now, there were two things I found new this year and I've been loving them both. And one of them is this. So this is the Annie's Halloween Bunny Graham. So basically what it is, it is the orange and chocolate flavored bunnies. For Halloween. So they're colored, the fun Halloween colors, but they are honey flavored for the orange and chocolate flavored for the black 
or the chocolate bunny. So good. And this is a pretty good sized package. You get quite a few of the bunnies in there. Cures that sweet tooth for two smart points. Not bad, not bad, Annie's. And lastly is another new find for me this year. And that is the little miniature Made Good Chocolate Granola Mini Bars. I love the Made Good products. They're made good. They have fabulous ingredients, but the bars can be a little bit on the point heavy side. So these little bars, now they are little because you can see them in my palm, but these are only two smart points. So they're nice if you're craving something sweet, if you're craving a granola bar, and again, just a great thing to throw in your lunch that is actually good for you and made with healthy ingredients. So with that being said, head on over to Target, pick up their Halloween snacks, point friendly and delicious. Next up is another item that you see me eat all the time in my what I eat in a days, but it has absolutely 100 a million trillion percent become one of my favorite things. And that is the healthy eating all the time and go bars. This is the peanut butter granola bar with cranberry. This one and this one, which is the peanut butter granola bar chocolate. These two are my all time favorites. But what I love most about these bars is they are so filling because the ingredients in here are whole ingredients, peanut butter, coconut flour, honey, nothing artificial. And the macros on these bad boys are insane. So good. The macros are so good. They range anywhere from six to seven smart points and they range anywhere from about 195 calories to about 210 calories, which is not bad. It fills you up. I'm telling you, this will fill you up for hours. So good for you. And the macros, those macros, honey, are amazing. I generally only count these as six points. I don't worry if it's six or seven. I track them as six. A little bit of a Weight Watchers Rebel there. But I figure the calories, six points for 200 calories is reasonable. I love these. I love, love, love them. The only flavor that I have not enjoyed, and this is my personal preference, they have a mocha peanut butter coffee one. I didn't like it at all. I thought the coffee was very bitter tasting with the chocolate. It just made the bar really bitter and I didn't like it at all, but every other flavor delicious. These two though are my favorites. Now I do not have a dis an affiliate link or anything. However, she did offer you guys 12% off of your order. My code is here on the screen. I don't receive anything in return for you ordering other than the satisfaction of you purchasing a bar that is amazing. I know it's a lot of points, but you can use this as a meal substitute because it literally keeps you full for so long. So head over to Healthy Eating on the Go. And my last food find is an all-time favorite. Literally one of my favorite parts of fall, this. This, my friends, is a delicata squash. I buy these at Trader Joe's. They are 99 cents a piece, but I know that you can find them at most stores. But let me just tell you how delicious these are. They're very, very easy to prepare. You do not have to peel the skin. You actually eat the skin of these. So you simply slice this in half. You dig out the seeds and stuff on the inside. It's similar to a pumpkin. You cut it up into half moon shaped rings and you throw this bad boy in your oven or your air fryer and it comes out crunchy with a little bit of sweetness. So incredibly delicious. And the best part, zero smart points. We eat this all the time. We love it in the air fryer. We love it in the oven. We've barbecued it. I'm telling you, you guys, you're missing out if you don't hop on the Delicata Squash bandwagon because they're only out for just a couple of months as they are a fall vegetable or fruit. I think they're a fruit. If you know, let me know down below, but I think this is actually classified as a fruit. Get some delicata squash. It is so good. All right, guys, let's talk all things home, all things household that are my favorites for the upcoming three months. So first being fall, being my favorite time of year. I love Scentsy. I love their fall scents. They're so awesome. I really like their scents because they last a long time in your burner. So I did order a couple of favorites. So I wanted to show you my two favorite scents for fall from Scentsy. So the first one is this one here. Oh my gosh, so good. This is first day of fall. Now it has a spicy, sweet, leafy outdoor smell, if that makes any sense at all. But it definitely has the scent of fall, just being outside on a fall day, but with that few notes of cinnamon. Oh, so good, love this one. And then my other favorite scent for fall, 
is this guy here. This one is outstanding. And this is Autumn Herb. Oh, it's cinnamon and cloves and all things fall. I am so excited. Oh, I love these. So if you have a burner or a wax burner where you like these little wax melts, highly recommend Scentsy. I do not sell Scentsy. However, one of our fellow WW Tribe members does. Her name is Melissa Doffer. I'm going to link her website and a place for you to order Scentsy down in the description box below. So if you wanna check it out, see what's new with Scentsy, they have a full line of home care, cleaning supplies, pet supplies, and then of course your traditional burners and plugins and wax melts. So down in the description box will be the link for these. Definitely check them out, order your favorite fall scents, and it supports a fellow Jen's WW tribe member, but can't wait to toss these into my burner. So in my what I eat in a day video, I show you guys how I make my coffee and I get a gazillion questions on this. So this is a little baby measuring cup. You can see here that it does a total of four tablespoons. So this is a baby four tablespoon measuring cup. Absolutely perfect for coffee creamer because you can put up to four tablespoons in here, measure it out, it takes a lot less time than doing one tablespoon at a time, or even putting it on your food scale. Highly recommend this, it's from Walmart. It was $1.97. I don't know if you can find this everywhere. In fact, I had to add this to my online pickup order several times before it was actually in stock. So maybe the word has gotten out about this because this is a huge time saver with coffee creamer. And I love it, and you could really use it in baking and cooking, anything you need up to four tablespoons for. Love this little baby measuring cup. Next up is a planner. With the new year coming and planning out our meals and our goals and the things that we want to accomplish in 2020, I have found the best planner on the market. I am not kidding you guys when I say this, the best planner. Not only is it gorgeous, but it is comprehensive and full of everything that you could ever dream in a planner and that is the Erin Condren. Now, I'm gonna scoot over to give you a better view. Here we go. So this is my Erin Condren planner. I'm obsessed, literally obsessed. I use this for every facet of my life. As you know, I'm a real estate agent, so this is how I keep track of my clients, my showings, I track my mileage in here. It literally tracks my entire life. It is so gorgeous. So I wanna open it up and I wanna show you guys how it kind of looks for the month. So let's first go here to September. So here, put my pen out. So there is like the beginning page. So every month has this gorgeous, page with a beautiful quote and then the next page of it is going to have a spot where you can plan some goals for the month so mine are always weight loss related real estate related but a place that you can plan your goals and then i love this don't judge on how scribbly and full that this is but this is the month at a glance portion of the planner so this is where i'm going to jot down my daily appointments and then also there is a section with large blocks so i have the horizontal planner large blocks where you can also track a little bit more in depth of what's going on for that day so i love this planner it's beautiful and as you can see you can customize it it does come with stickers there's markers that you can buy um in fact in the back of the planner here i'll show you guys it actually does come with some stickers and then i just bought the extra sticker pack so you can see here but it does come with some pages of stickers and they're absolutely gorgeous. But I did buy the extra sticker pack because I love me some stickers. And the best part about this is it's totally customizable. The size, the shape that you want, your months, your days listed out on your planner is totally customizable. You can do the horizontal like I did. You can do vertical. You literally get to pick every step of your planner, even the color of your binding of your planner. This is the rose gold. And you can see here that I've customized mine with my initials. I have to pick out my cover. I mean, it's such a fabulous planner. It literally has everything that you would ever need in a planner there's a place to set some goals there's even a bullet journaling section every month so if you're into the bullet journaling it's fully customizable personalizable amazing and this again is the Erin Condren life 
planner. I will put a discount code here on the screen. All you guys have to do is join their insider club. Once you join the club, it's free to join. You'll get $10 off of your order. So you can hop over and order a life planner and get $10 off. Check out her website. I mean, there is oodles and oodles of planner bliss on her website. But if you're looking for a great planner to finish out the rest of this year, mine actually goes through all of next year as well. To finish out the rest of this year and be ready to start 2020, definitely check out the Erin Condren. Next up is my baby, literally my baby, my mini waffle maker. So this is the Dash mini waffle maker and mine is in kind of the teal color. Oh my gosh, you guys, if you watch my meal prep, you know I use this all the time. I'm literally obsessed with this as well. I love it. I'm thinking I may get a second one. They're literally like $10 on Amazon. I will have it linked down below. Uh, that will take you directly to Amazon and you can order it there, ship it to your doorstep. Love it. I think I may get a second one just so when I'm making mini waffles or chaffles or whatever you're making, you can kind of pump them out a little bit quicker with more than one waffle maker. But if you are seeing all the hype of the mini waffles, the chaffles, the protein waffles, using the Devotion Nutrition Protein Powder, that is also linked down below as well. Definitely head on over to Amazon and order a Dash Mini Waffle Maker. So many colors, silver, white, red, and this adorable teal. Definitely get one if you wanna copy my recipes because I use this all the time in meal prep. It's so cute. And last, but certainly not least for household lifestyle, is my meal planner. Now, you know I meal prep every week. I meal plan every week. I actually have a video here on my channel where I walk you through step by step how I meal prep, how I find my recipes, how I tweak them to make them WW friendly. It's a fabulous video. I literally walk you through step by step. I will link that down below. And how I track my life and plan my food is I use my Carrie L meal planner. Now I show this every week in my grocery haul, but I still get a million questions about it. Best meal planner ever. It's absolutely gorgeous. I actually have the eight and a half by 11. So I actually have the larger meal planner, but it literally is absolutely positively a gorgeous meal planner. It has everything that you need pretty much to plan every facet of meals. So there's a section to track your favorite recipe sites. There's a section to plan your meals, to take some notes, to plan gatherings, and also an inventory section where you can inventory your pantry, your fridge, your freezer, and your spices to know exactly what you have on hand. But for the meal planning tab, that's the yellow tab here in the planner. Let me show you, let me go ahead. I'm gonna open up to a fresh month just so you can see one that isn't written all over. So every month you do get a monthly at a glance calendar. And what I use this for is I track my meals so that I can see them at a glance. So let's say that it's Tuesday night and I just finished cleaning up dinner and I wanna make sure that I have everything ready for Wednesday night's dinner. I can see it here on the monthly calendar and then I can make sure that I pull out the meat that I need out of the freezer. I can make sure that I have all of the supplies on hand for that meal. It's just a really easy, quick tool to do it by the month. And then each week there is a weekly menu where you can track what you wanna make for the entire week. And then there's also a detachable grocery list that's perforated that comes off that you can take to the grocery store. I love this. You can see that I use mine literally every single week and my grocery list is always missing because I do use that for my groceries. And you can also see that I really like the monthly feature as well where I can plan all my meals. So if you're looking for a fabulous meal planner, this one literally you guys will last you the entire year, more than a year. I highly recommend the Carriel. There are different sizes. This one again, it's the big one, this is the eight and a half by 11, but they have a smaller one, they have digital versions. You can use my code here on the screen, you'll get 10% off of your order. Doesn't matter if you buy the perforated spiral bound one or if you do the digital version, you'll get the 10% off. So if you need some help planning your meals, pick up the carry out. All right guys, the last part of my favorites that I wanna share with you are my beauty favorites. Now I have a lot of new beauty favorites. I've been experimenting with some different products, seeing what I like, and I have found quite a few fantastic beauty finds. So first, I wanna start with a foundation. Now, as you know, I really do like the IT Cosmetics. In fact, I have quite a few of their products here as my favorites, but I've really been enjoying their foundation. So this is the IT Cosmetics CC Plus Foundation. This is SPF 40, which is 
amazing actually really amazing and this is the oil free matte and i am in the color light medium i really have been loving this foundation i like that it has the kind of pump top and it goes on flawlessly like your skin is smooth there's no cakiness no buildup. I, I'm literally absolutely loving it. It is a little on the pricey side, but it lasts forever. I use about one and a half pumps to do my entire face. And I'm telling you, it just makes a difference on how the makeup lays on your face. None of that weird like creases. This makeup you see right here, I've had on all day and it looks fabulous. There's no cakiness, no lines. Love this. So all of these products I will find them online and link them down below for you. But I do actually highly recommend the It Cosmetics CC Plus Foundation. While we're talking It Cosmetics, let's talk about my all-time favorite products. I've repeatedly purchased these over the last few months. I'm literally in love. And I've gotten a lot of compliments from you, from just people out in public, about my skin looking so good. And I am attributing, attributing it it's a tongue twister, 100% to these products. So first, this is the It Cosmetics Confidence in a Face Cream. So this is the cream that I use on my all over face. I put it down my neck and on my chest just to prevent aging. You know, we get a lot of aging on our chest and our neck, so I'm trying to, as best as I can, omit that from happening. This is kind of what the cream looks like. So it is a nice, thick cream. It goes on absolutely beautifully it soaks into the skin i've read a couple of reviews online that it makes someone's skin dry i don't find that at all my skin is supple and moist and delicious and with this i also have been using the it cosmetics eye cream so this is the confidence in an eye cream so this is awesome as well so this is what i will use here around my eye and off to where you get the crow's feet it's almost gone, literally. I'm like scraping the bottom of it, but this is what it looks like. It's a little bit lighter cream, and it literally, I'm not kidding you guys, lasts forever. I have been through one and a half jars of the face cream, and I'm still on my first jar of the eye cream. They are a little bit expensive. You're just under $100 for both of them, but they last a long time, and I'm telling you, I promise you, my skin has never looked better. I am definitely in It Cosmetics Confidence in a Cream fan. I get a lot of questions from you guys about my lashes. So I used to get eyelash extensions, but ain't nobody got time to go sit there for two hours every two weeks while they put eyelashes on my eyelashes. So I've been loving just your traditional artificial lash, and I have found some that I am obsessed with. They are the best lashes. I'm actually wearing them right now. I don't know if you guys can see that, but they are so long and so pretty, but they still look natural and they're so cheap. They're so inexpensive. So this is actually what the packaging looks like. It literally is very plain Jane packaging. I buy this off of Amazon and it just says three fashion lashes, glam, volume, sexy. That about sums it up. So these are actually my favorite lashes. It is just under $7 for three pairs. I wear my lashes anywhere from two to four days, and that's just gonna depend on how much glue you use and are you able to pull them off gently enough that they hold their shape. So there's a lot of factors that contribute into how many days you can wear them, but you can definitely wear them more than one day. And the glue that I like is the Duo. So this is the Duo Lash Glue, and this is in the dark tone so when i'm putting it on to my black liner it blends right in and just enhances the darkness of my liner and my lash line so love this duo glue obsessed with these lashes i do go back and forth but these are by far my very favorite lashes so inexpensive and seriously they just give you that beautiful glam but still with that little bit of natural look i've had several people ask me if i have eyelash extensions and i do not they're just these and that's crazy that they think these cost 60 70 100 dollars like lash extensions no they're 6.89 a pack so i'm going to link both of these down below i do buy these off of amazon highly highly recommend both of these. I've also discovered a face wash that I'm absolutely loving. I struggle with a face wash that is a cream cleanser. The kind that comes out looking a lot like toothpaste. That's just that white creamy cleanser. For me, I struggle with it actually cleaning my face. And when I get out of the shower and I tone my skin, I end up getting quite a bit of makeup and dirt residue. So I have 
eliminated cream cleansers and I like the kind that get really foamy and soapy because I feel that I'm getting a much better clean on my face. So I found this one. I actually bought mine at Ulta. If I can find it on Amazon, I'll link it below. I'll link it wherever I can find it. And that's this right here. And this face wash, you guys, is awesome. So it's called the Fab Pore, and it says Purifying Foam Cleanser. So what's in this is Cool Capsule Soothe Technology with Witch Hazel for clean, clear, and healthy looking skin. And it does. It is similar to the soap, like the pump top soap. Can you guys see that, how it's the pump top? Oh, and it smells so good. It smells minty and fresh. So this is very similar to the pump style of soap and it comes out foamy. So I feel like I just get a great cleanse on my skin and I don't have any residue when I get out of the shower and actually wipe my face with some toner. So if you're looking for a great face wash, super inexpensive. I want to say it was around $7. Lasts forever. I use about eight pumps every time that I wash my face and you can see here I've used this one several times and there's still a ton left love this face wash so if you struggle with getting all your makeup and dirt off your face highly recommend trying this one it definitely does the job speaking of faces I found something amazing on Amazon and I've been loving it I know it looks a little bit lackluster but I just want to show you guys these are face masks and look at all of these now I have used several, 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 several of these face masks already. The thing about these is they come, they're dermal face masks. As you can see here, they say dermal, but you can also see that everything is in Japanese. So these actually come from Japan, but these are collagen face masks. They're awesome, legit awesome face masks. And this, my friend, this is an 18 pack of masks all different kinds. Last night I actually used aloe. This is a pearl. There's all types of the collagen face masks. An 18 pack of them for under $10. And honestly, you guys, these are great face masks. There's tons and tons of different kinds. You can just see the different brands of face, or not brands, but kinds of face masks. These are awesome. So if you're looking for a fabulous face mask at an inexpensive price, Highly recommend these. What I do is I put these on for 15 to 20 minutes and then whatever residue is left over on my face, I just take my hand and just smooth it into my face and let my skin absorb everything. But this is an absolute steal on face masks. So I'm gonna link these below. These are from Amazon. If you can get by the Japanese writing, figure out the instructions, pretty amazing face mask. With winter coming down the road, my skin gets dry and I get those little bumps on my arms. I hate those things. I don't know where they come from. I don't know why I have them. So I've recently discovered body polish and body polish is something that you can use that has granules that exfoliates your skin, but softly where it doesn't cause, it's not harsh. It doesn't cause any redness or open wounds or anything like that, but it does exfoliate your skin and helps get rid of those annoying little bumps that you get on your arm, your back, your legs, awesome so i have found a great body polish for inexpensive and this is it right here so this is the tree hut shea sugar scrub and tropical mango so this is what the front of the package looks like this body polish is amazing amazing fabulous fabulous it smells decadent and fruity and fresh and it works like a charm i literally put some in my hand and i rub it on the areas that I want to exfoliate and my skin comes out so soft, so soft. So I always wash my body first and then I'll exfoliate before I get out of the shower. And I only do this two to three times a week. It makes such a huge difference on my skin and those annoying little bumps. So I'm going to link this down below. I know you can get this at Ulta and you can also get this at Amazon. Highly recommend this. Love it. And last, but certainly not least in the beauty department, is a hair mask. This hair of mine, you guys, since I added a little blonde to it, bleached it out, it is drier than it used to be. And I have very thick, dry, coarse hair as it is, 
but it has gotten a little bit drier since I bleached it to add this this more caramelized blonde which I love it's just dried my hair out quite a lot so I was in need of a hair mask and I did a lot of research to find one that was not only affordable because these suckers can be a lot of money but one that has great ratings and I have found one and it is awesome and that is this so this is the it's a 10 Oh, it's upside down. There you go, it's a 10 hair mask. This is what it looks like. This is amazing. So what I do is once a week to once every two weeks, when I get done shampooing my hair, I'll put some of this hair mask in my hair. Let me show you what it looks like. So it's just kind of a milky kind of color of hair mask. It lasts a long time because you're only using a small amount. And what I'll do is I'll rub it through my hair. If you ha your hair has a tendency to get greasy, avoid putting it up here in your scalp and just focus it here on the ends of your hair. I put this in, I wrap my hair in a plastic bag, just like a grocery store bag, and I shave my legs, wash my body, wash my face, spend 15 to 20 minutes in the shower and really let my hair just absorb this hair mask. My hair comes out soft, silky, shiny, amazing I, it literally you guys this is amazing and again if you don't have dry hair like myself you can just focus on the ends or the dry portions of your hair and you will see amazing results this is a little bit on the pricey side i want to say it was about 32 dollars but again you don't use very much you're using this once a week to once every two weeks so it's going to last a long time i've had this for a couple of months now and i've used it a few times well worth the money, has great reviews, great products. I am gonna link it down below. If you struggle and you need a hair mask, definitely get the It's a 10, it's amazing. Thank you for joining me on this episode of My Favorites. Now this covers the October, November, December quarter of the year, the fourth quarter of the year. Can you believe it's almost 2020? So I will be back in January with my next favorites video. By then I should have accumulated a ton of new favorites to share with you. So I hope you enjoyed seeing my WW food favorites, my household slash fun favorites, and then my skincare and makeup favorites. These are all awesome products. They will all be linked down in the description box below. I do have several other favorite videos on my channel. I've done several of these. I used to do them monthly, but now I do them quarterly just so that I have more to show you. So sorry in advance for this being a long video, but you got a ton of ideas on some of my favorite things. All of the links are down below. All of the discount codes are down below. Check it out. Order some of my favorites. I promise you'll love everything that I showed you. If you are new to my channel, hello and welcome. Make sure that you hit that subscribe button and that little bell. That way you're notified every time I upload. You don't wanna miss out. I upload almost daily. Thumbs up this video, comment down below. Let me know what are your favorites of my favorites and what are the things that you have to get your hands on. And again, you guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys.